Hey guys, I hope all is well with everyone. So we are looking at the baby monster. Um, I'm pretty sure I got all of them. I don't know if some of them... I mean, I'll try. I'll give it a shot. But a couple of them, I'm not sure if I'll be able to, like, if they're Filipino or Taiwanese, Vietnamese. I mean, if we have aces that come out, then yes. I, because if aces come out, that represent a yes. But... I'll have timestamps down below in the description box if you want to jump around. Um, please don't forget to hit that like button, um, share, comment, subscribe. <clears throat> and if you're interested in personal reading, I have information down below. So we're going to start off with, will there be a foreigner added to the group? Will Baby Monster add a foreigner to the group? Will Baby Monster add a foreigner to the group? One moment, my computer just popped up something. Thank you. I had to restart my computer. Will there be, a, will Baby Monster add a foreigner to the group? It looks as though it's a possibility, like a thought at least, with how energies are right now. It looks at least as though it's a thought. Because we have this planning here with the Eight of Pentacles and the King of Pentacles. So wanting to get to the goal for this opportunity here, this new opportunity. There's departure. There's going to be like contemplation here in solitude. So it's like they're they're reevaluating what's what they have or what's there and then making a decision from there. Fantasizing, thinking about it all. So, if there's going to be one, it could be an air sign. Um, I would definitely say that if there would be a foreigner added to the group, I mean, don't get me wrong, we don't have any aces. So, that's not like a confirmed yes. However, we do have like it looks like as a like a reevaluation like I said, but seeing this air sign from another perspective, their journey, it looks like bringing in this opportunity. So with how energies are right now, it looks as though there's a thought about it, a contemplation. Um, and it's a possibility that it is an air sign. And if they do take this air sign, then it's as though it's going to make them see things from another perspective, like what they hand out for opportunities for the change. Like with working on a new opportunity, it's like going to open up new doors to a whole new world for 
for YG Entertainments. A whole new thought process. On how they like build groups in that. Okay. We will get to, let's do the Filipino, Taiwanese, and Vietnamese ones, because we just asked about um, if they're going to add a foreigner. So would this foreigner be Filipino? Would this foreigner be Filipino? This one here is saying it's almost like a thought. Like, <laughs> excuse me. Um, I'm trying to think of how to explain what I'm seeing here. So there's this apathetic offer that comes in. So they're to a chain connection here. So what it looks like here. It looks like somebody that might have been Filipino tried to audition, but they weren't satisfied. Because we have this chain connection with a new creation, taking an action, keeping things unknown here, feeling apathetic about offers here. So... I would say no on that one. The next one will be asking if the member, the foreigner, would be Taiwanese. Would the foreigner be Taiwanese? Can you please tell us? Will the foreigner be Taiwanese? It's almost like this one here for Taiwanese. It seems like there's a great movement here, right? It's being held on tight. But there's sadness and regret reflecting on it, looking on it, on this earth sign here. Feminine energy earth sign. It does also have the energy of nurturing finances, career. healing, right? It's like mending a project here, whatever, but it's almost like they gave somebody that's Taiwanese um, a thought, but then they rethought it and it just, it didn't, it's, they, it's not going to pan out. There's some type of like really hard control here. It gets stressful to control. It's 
something here with potentially somebody that's Taiwanese. It's almost like they gave it a thought, but then they rethought it and thought of something negative about it and was like, nope, this isn't good for our Wheel of Fortune here. It's a tricky justice, tricky move. I don't know why it could be the person's situation. Okay. Next, we're going to ask if the foreigner that was going to be added to Baby Monster is Vietnamese. Will the foreigner that's going to be added to Baby Monster Vietnamese? Well, we're starting off good with the Nine of Cups, which fulfillment. Handout gift secret here. So the way the cards are looking here, very much so. Because we're starting off first off with the Nine of Cups, which is all about wish fulfillment, getting that wish, that want. With whatever they were looking for, they got it. This type of handout here, some type of help with the star card, the wish. Um, getting a lot of attention here. And then the High Priestess being secret about it. The Ten of Pentacles on the top. So with how the cards are coming out. Oh yeah. Yeah. It's a very good possibility that if they do add a foreigner. If they decide to stick with a foreigner. Um. There very well could be somebody that is Vietnamese, or at least has that within their blood. I'm hearing maybe even ancestry, like their ancestry line, have Vietnamese in it. Alrighty, our next question will be, will they have, sorry. Will they change the members of Baby Monster before they debut? Will they change the number? Change the members. <laughs> Sorry, it's a long question. Will they change the members before they debut? Will they change? Whoa, whoa. It looks like they're working on it. Because it's like this chained creative contract here, this third party is doing a lot and they're really not like explaining a lot here, obviously, right? But Within this question, though, and the Ten of Swords coming out, that's telling me that um, there's a very good chance, for sure, because it seems as though they're not letting out all the information, most likely to build suspense. But they're going to think about what they've decided in the past and almost like do like a reevaluation, decide things, make difficult decisions about the members, about maybe even maybe changing them. Yeah. They're putting all their energy, though, into this.
Why do we have this, though, within that? It's almost like something's not going to go right. Like they're not going to make a right decision. They're trying to make a right decision on this, but it looks like they're going to mess something up here. Because we got the Seven of Swords and the Three of Swords. So, you know what? They could probably eliminate some people here. Um, we do have a more specific question coming up about this. But if you look at it, it's information about the Six of Cups, which is youth. Um, also, well, youthful energy. And things are like, you know, childish or childlike energy here. But putting all the energy in it does also represent past as well so if we think of it as what they've came out with in the past or in the recent past they're putting all their energy into this this loving connection here of this third party this group here they're being sneaky here or something with them with the seven of swords and the three of swords it's almost like I'm really picturing... Oh, my goodness. Um, for some reason, I'm picturing, like, this type of competition that they all have to, like, kind of fulfill and, like, a test. And if they pass it, then they're closer. But if they don't, then they get put under this list here. The Seven of Swords and Three of Swords of Happiness. It's almost like they have to prove themselves to stay. That's how I'm picking up the Seven of Swords and the Three of Swords laying out here. Especially starting out with the Ten of Swords with this chain connection that's the creative contract. So, to me, yes, it looks as though there's a very good chance that they will change the members before they debut. Alrighty, our next question will be, will YG fully accept the members of Baby Monster? Will YG fully accept the members of Baby Monster? So far it looks like it's going to be a little bit of a hard time. We have our Ten of Wands here, something weighing heavy here. The burden, this plan, this work, the efforts they're putting in here. It's almost like it's going in to uh, come and bite them in the butt for some reason. I wonder if they're getting over their head with some things like creating too much. It like it's going to be really hard for them to um, feel any type of happiness with closing a cycle or receiving anything with the world, like, traveling in that. Because there's a lot to do with the world with, with Baby Monster. I mean, if they're adding foreigners, world card doesn't surprise me. Um, but there's also travel. It can also be touring in this. But there's a blockage because there's a destructive moment here. 
it's like they're not going to be satisfied when they go to debut. I actually wonder if they're going to stretch out. Like, do, do they have a debut date? Because it looks like they're kind of hesitant on <laughs> debuting. At least when they want to. Because of the situation. Because there's this tower moment that creates a blockage. And it's all just weighing heavy on them. There's a lot, there's a lot going on here. We're trying to make this new journey, this path happy and successful. But right now, there's this apathetic feeling. Almost like lost feeling. Not knowing what to do. Because of this tower moment. Let's look into the tower here. Why do we have this tower card here? Why do we have this tower card? It's like not being satisfied here with the decisions. With the decisions that's been made, they're not going to be satisfied. They're being really picky because they want to achieve this Ten of Cups here. So it looks like they're not going to accept the members. I keep feeling like they're going to juggle things around because things aren't going as expected here on this journey, this new journey that they wanted to take this new path towards happiness but really it's just creating this apathetic feeling not knowing what to do because everything's starting to weigh heavy on their shoulders and it's just like one thing after the next around the corner here alrighty the next requested question is will YG cut one or two of the members will YG Entertainments cut one or two of the members we have a few here so we got a snack get comfortable Starting off with this Ace of Swords, taking action with this Queen of Swords here. Working on a project, investigating more into the Wheel of Fortune here. Okay, this Queen of Swords looks like it's going to um, create an issue here. She's going to be the one that's creating this destructive moment here. So it looks like they're going to be looking further into this Queen of Swords here, investigating more, comparing to the project that they want to apply or to. But it looks like this Queen of Swords, with her creating this destructive, apathetic feeling here. It's like the parting here from the fantasy of having this big project, this creation, because of this. And it looks like their thought process is going to go towards a fire sign then for victory here because their hands are tied behind their back not knowing what to do. So they sit in solitude thinking here that this queen of wands here could fire sign would help them break down any of the issues here. It's almost like outweighing the negative that this queen of swords brought in. 
it's like this this queen of wands is more positive more receptive to what they want to do like more on board here because it will quickly draw in the new creation for them so to me with what's out here it looks like they're going to reevaluate whoever this queen of swords is okay they will take action towards her after investigating and something here looking further into it it's like they see something that they don't like or come across something that they don't like something they don't approve and then departing them from this from this big project that they're fantasizing about and it looks like they're bringing in this fire sign here because they see victory with this fire sign So I would say that they're going to at least eliminate one to bring in another. Alrighty, our next question is going to be why is YG not steady about the members? Why is YG not steady about the members? Why is YG not steady about the members? This Queen of Swords keep coming up. It's almost like they keep looking into things, but there's secret information. They're holding on tight. It's almost like they, they like, want to keep how do you say it the anticipation going the excitement there's a lot of thought going on with what they're doing with putting all these members together it's like they want it to be perfect but you know the thing is if you get so focused on something to be perfect there's a good chance that you're going to overlook something and it could become damaging, you know? Why is... Why is YG not steady about the, the members? Why is YG not steady about the members? Yeah. They want to make sure that everything goes right with this new chosen path, new partnership of celebrity. It's like they're learning from things from their past, from the past experiences, applying them to this new love opportunity that they are applying work to here. All their energy, their efforts, making it grow and flourish. Um, but it's still young to them here with the six of cups like it's still fresh it's still new so really to me what I'm seeing is that they're a little indecisive um but they want things to be perfect they want things to be right investigating it's like they're learning what they want how they want things to be they apply it and then they investigate a little further. It's almost like a step-by-step -step investigate. Um, like, okay, um, let's investigate on this work project here, this new love here. Let's get to know you, right? So if we get to, if they would add somebody, then they're going to try to get to know them a little further in. And they want to make sure that they fit what they want them all to be. Also, I would assume that they would want some type of them all being able to get along together so it's easier for them. It just makes things a lot nicer rather than having a lot of fights and then force trying to force everybody to get together and just make it a lot harder. If they all get along... It makes it a lot easier to keep them together. 
So really, they're trying to make the right steps uh, to achieve the goal that they want with this new partnership of celebrities getting attention here. So that's why they're pretty much indecisive. They're unsure, but they're sure what they want. They know what they want, but it's hard to, to get it. It's like trying to get the perfect mix, you know? Because if they're going to have a group, sometimes it could be a struggle to get that amount of people to be able to get along with each other. Alrighty, so our next question is going to be, will they stick to five or six members? I believe I've asked this question before, but I'm willing to ask again because energies do change all the time. So you never know. And they seem to be very indecisive because they want things to be perfect, which is understandable, I think. Will YG stick to five or six members? Will YG stick to five or six members? Okay. I'm seeing six. <laughs> so, we have this happiness. So, you know how I said energies change all the time? So, if you go back, um, I'm not sure if it's part one or part two, um, but I'll put it up at the top of the screen. And I'll try at the end, too. The, I'll do the playlist at the end. Um, but there's this happiness that's being seen from another perspective. And it's charging towards victory, right? But it's the Six of Wands. This is the only one that gives us a number, right? As I continue on through here, it gives us clarification here. Big clarification. Big, big, big. The world, departure, wheel of fortune, and work. Putting all the labor in. So, with... How the energies are reading tonight with this question, it looks as though they're going to be sticking with six right now. If they decide to get rid of one compared to the previous questions, it seems as though they'll swap the members out for somebody else. Rather than lower the number. Our next one is going to be, will they change the lineup of Baby Monster? Will the lineup change for the group Baby Monster? It looks like they very well could be, um, because it looks like they're healing something here with this earth energy here, feminine energy earth sign. This is also the energy of trying to nurture and grow something that's financial and career as well. Um, so this person could be an earth sign that they're going to be moving for a swords healing, laying things to rest here. There's some type of issue here with this pentacles here that is creating sleepless nights of a departure of their wheel of fortune. They're investigating further into it because it's, it's turning into a tower moment. They're investigating to the point where they're, and then they'll, they'll think in solitude, like think of a solution here, what to do next, and then send out a message here. There's some type of communication. So it looks like they 
they very well are going to be. And this person isn't going to be very happy about it, which is understandable. They probably had their heart set on it. Um, probably got used to it, got used to the idea, even if they weren't in the beginning, whatever their position may be. Um, but it looks as though, yes, whoever this earth sign is very well could. And it's going to feel painful to them. They're going to be very upset. Could wind up kind of being childlike about it. Because they could have thought like, well, where I'm, where you placed me. Like, I felt like I was on top of the world here. Defeating everything. But now this changes around. And creates heartache and pain. It's almost like things weren't working out the way that they liked it with wherever they placed that earth sign. So, it looks like they will be changing the lineup. Okay, our last question is, will the lineup change before they debut? Will the lineup... Oh, wow. Anxious. Will the lineup change before they debut? Nope, sorry. Nose is itchy. Didn't even get to ask the question again. That's why I heard, you heard that loud huff there. I don't know who this air sign is, but it looks like it's going to be, they will be an issue. Especially around the time when they debut. It's almost like they'll create some type of issue that's going to be such an, a challenge. It's going to have their hands tied behind their back here. And they thought things were, were great. But there's something here they're not happy about. Yeah, it looks like. I'm really willing to bet whoever this air sign is are going to... I know the question was, like, if they'll change the lineup before they debut. <clears throat> and what it looks like is saying is... <laughs> that they're going to be walking away from this air sign before they debut. Um, they're learning something from this person. They're not happy about it. There's something, like, sneaky about it. It's like something that they find out while they're manifesting this chain creation here, putting effort into it, having to walk away because of learning something here, learning something valuable along the path about this air sign, and it, it makes them rethink. So with changing before they debut, yeah, it looks like they're going to, I'm willing to bet, get rid of this air sign before they debut they might come out saying that that they have this air sign um as a member but before they might exclude them or cut them out um that's everything that i have for you guys um please don't forget to hit that like button share comment subscribe <clears throat> if you're interested in a personal reading i do have information down below until next time you guys off you to zane bye bye